Hi, this is Defend Gogo, Technical Analyst of LS Blue. So in this video, I'll discuss about uh, Zinc, right? So now you can see this is a Zinc chart and that is a daily chart. And I think you remember yesterday I given a resistance line around 184.21. So why I place this is a resistance line? Why I'm not placing here as a resistance line or resistance line, right? Uh, or where? I'm not placing here as a resistance line in this area. So why I place in middle of this line, right? And I given this a resistance line. If they break this level, you can go for buy, right? So now we can see the price are not able to break this resistance line, and again price just drop down, right? So now today you can see we have some candlestick pattern. Let me zoom a little more than it comes. To. You just think yourself what candlestick pattern are forming right now now you can see we have a small candle after that this is a large candle right and this small candle are engulfed by the large candle this pier is candle so when they are forming this type of candlestick pattern this is called engulfing pattern right i remember that pattern this is called engulfing pattern and here we can see beer is harami pattern right and this is called engulfing pattern. Remember, both are same, but you just uh, uh, just uh, change the direction like a smaller letter and larger previous. And here you can see smaller previous and larger difference. So difference between them, right? So uh, according to the candlestick pattern, what is the logic? What is the like uh, formula? So formula is that candlestick pattern must be appear in a right location or right place now question is that this uh, uh, engulfing pattern are forming in a right location yes or no answer is yes because according to the projection method they creating lower low lower high lower low lower high right lower low we have seen lower high here and previous market behavior the price is following moving average 20 right bouncing from 20 right 20 moving average and bouncing from 20 and we have seen this is the, this pattern of forming below this 20 because trend is down right so that uh, that is why we can say like that this candlestick pattern are forming in a right place and a right location now we have confirmed that uh, we have seen here a bearish candlestick pattern so which is called uh, uh, engulfing pattern right so now what is the trading behind engulfing pattern so don't do that mistake by seeing this candlestick pattern and the right location don't enter suddenly in this market the trading uh, like a uh, method is that you just place your sell order just below this pattern right so let me uh, show you this was candlestick pattern right we have seen this is harami pattern we have seen and here was lower point right uh, so now you can see let me draw we have seen this is and uh, here we have seen lower point and always sell just below this pattern right so that means our trading entry was just a little more here like uh, below this pattern right so today in this uh, candlestick pattern we have seen this is our lower point have you seen this is our lower point and we must place our sell order just in this area and so let me draw trend line then it comes to no properly right so always try to learn because always try to learn how i'm analyzing the market and where i'm placing order right so let me show you and here we can see we have seen this is a lower point right i exactly drawn a lower point here and here we can see i let me exist a little more here and i place average 10 line so remember uh, most of the people are thinking here we have seen this is a pattern right so we have seen this is a range in this pattern right this is our pattern and this is our range but according to me and uh, the most of the people are they are not able to control their emotion but according to me i never trade in between these rings because we have seen a 
candlestick pattern and in between this candlestick pattern i never take any position remember if they break this level i'll go for buy above if they break this below uh, supporting line i'll go for sell right but in this uh, like in between this area i never gonna take any position i will wait and watch to break this both of side in which side they will break definitely i'll go for that side right that is my trading strategy so you keep your presence in your mind don't be hurry and don't enter anywhere right so we have seen the trading range right now and for the target let me draw the previous lower point and the target let me exist a little more here i'll close my position here right and another target you can see let me draw the previous higher more process area and that will be my target right so let's check it remember below 180 i'll sell and 140 184 sorry below 180 sell and uh, above 184 i'll buy right most of up most of the people are thinking here is a four rupees are different so how can i lose? uh how can i miss that uh, four rupees don't try to catch every point right always find out high probability trade so that is called high probability trade when when we we'll start buying above this area so that is called high probability trade and below this area this is called high probability trade. and in between this there is no high probability trade and don't trade in between all right so let's check it in a small time frame like a four hour now I can see according to the four hour method uh, they are creating like that right so here was lower low lower high lower low lower high and lower low and after that we have seen the create suddenly higher high this was previous lower high broke this area and after that they create a lower uh, higher low right so according to the price action method they are creating a higher low right so our trading strategy is that if they break this level so we'll go for buy right and if they break this level we'll start selling below right 180 now most of the people are thinking hey it will go up according to the price action method sometimes it's not working like that so let me show you if you see they are creating lower low right so definitely they are creating lower low and a lower high after that they create a higher low so suddenly price fell down right sometimes it happened right so and in a daily we have seen uh, they are forming a engulfing pattern right bearish engulfing pattern when they are forming this is a sign to uh, bearish right and they are forming in a right place that is what i'm telling so i'm looking for sell here right so let's check in a small time frame like uh, 15 minutes for or buy and sell let me zoom a little more here and we have seen here and you can see yesterday they are not able to break this level and we are looking for here right uh, buy above 184 this area most of the people are thinking hey i'll miss this opportunity so leave it don't try to catch every point right so now you can see we are looking for sell when they will break this supporting line so here was support 180 so we close our position around 178 this is our target and if they break this level so target was somewhere here right so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe thanks for watching